Timeline of stellar astronomy 2300 BC — First great period of star naming in China 134 BC — Hipparchus creates the magnitude scale of stellar apparent luminosities 185 AD — Chinese astronomers become the first to observe a supernova, the SN 185 964 — Abd al-Rahman al-Sufi writes the Book of Fixed Stars, in which he makes the first recorded observations of the Andromeda Galaxy and the Large Magellanic Cloud, and lists numerous stars with their positions, magnitudes, brightness, and color, and gives drawings for each constellation 1000s decade. The Persian astronomer, Abu Rehan al-Biruni, describes the Milky Way Galaxy as a collection of numerous nebulous stars 1006 Ali ibn Ridwan and Chinese astronomers observe the SN 1006, the brightest stellar event ever recorded 1054 — Chinese and Arab astronomers observe the SN 1054, responsible for the creation of the Crab Nebula, the only nebula whose creation was observed 1181 — Chinese astronomers observe the SN 1181 supernova 1580 — Taki al-Din measures the right ascension of the stars at the Constantinople Observatory of Taki ad-Din using an observational clock he invented and which he described as a mechanical clock with three dials which show the hours, the minutes, and the seconds. 1596 — David Fabricius notices that Myra's brightness varies 1672 — Geminano Montanari notices that Algol's brightness varies 1686 — Gottfried Kirk notices that Chi Cygna's brightness varies 1718 — Edmund Halley discovers stellar proper motions by comparing his astrometric measurements with those of the Greeks 1782 — John Goodrick notices that the brightness variations of Algol are periodic and proposes that it is partially eclipsed by a body moving around it 1784 — Edward Pigott discovers the first Cepheid variable star 1838 — Thomas Henderson, Friedrich Struve, and Friedrich Bessel measure stellar parallaxes 1844 — Friedrich Bessel explains the wobbling motions of Sirius and Procyon by suggesting that these stars have dark companions 1906 — Arthur Eddington begins his statistical study of stellar motions 1908 — Henrietta Leavitt discovers the Cepheid period luminosity relation 1910 — Edgner Hertzsprung and Henry Norris Russell study the relation between magnitudes and spectral types of stars 1924 — Arthur Eddington develops the main sequence mass-luminosity relationship 1929 — George Gamow proposes hydrogen fusion as the energy source for stars 1938 — Hans Bethe and Carl von Weizsäcker detail the proton-proton chain and CNO cycle in stars 1939 — Rupert Wilt realizes the importance of the negative hydrogen ion for stellar opacity 1952 — Walter Bodd distinguishes between Cepheid I and Cepheid II variable stars 1953 — Fred Hoyle predicts a carbon-12 resonance to allow stellar triple-alpha reactions at reasonable stellar interior temperatures 1961 — Chushiro Hayashi publishes his work on the Hayashi. Track of fully convective stars 1963 — Fred Hoyle and William A. Fowler conceive the idea of supermassive stars 1964 — Subramanian Chandrasekhar and Richard Feynman develop a general relativistic theory of stellar pulsations and show that supermassive stars are subject to a general relativistic instability 1967 — Eric Becklin and Jerry Neugebauer discover the becklin neugebauer object at 10 micrometers 1977 — May 25. The Star Wars film is released and became a worldwide phenomenon, boosting interests in stellar systems. 2012 — May 2 – First visual proof of existence of black holes. Suvi Ghazari's team in Johns Hopkins University, using the Hawaiian telescope Pan-STARRS-1, publish images of a supermassive black hole 2.7 million light-years away swallowing a red giant. See also Timeline of astronomy References, <references>